by clicking on this video, you have given yourself the chance to win some exclusive Upper Deck hockey cards as well as some other items. That's right, I have partnered up with Upper Deck to promote the fact that they have exclusive rights to future first overall pick, Alexis Lafreniere, and uh, they have sent me some really cool items that you also have the chance to win. So before I get into what you could win, here is what you have to do to enter. So now to enter the contest, you can go on Upper Deck's Instagram page, it is right here, and give them a follow, and then you can scroll right down to this photo right here, and enter the caption contest, and the contest ends in a couple of days, the 6th of October, so make sure you enter right before the draft happens. So now let's take a look at everything Upper Deck sent. So first of all, there is a very nice letter here. By the way, a massive thank you to Upper Deck for this. This is so awesome. And I'm really looking to uh, do some more collaborations in the future. And I really hope you all enjoy this one. This is a chance to win some super awesome items. And uh, this is what you could win too. So uh, 2020 NHL draft, that is October 6th. Matt, thank you for partnering with us to help promote our exclusive spokesman, Alex. Lafreniere during the 2020 NHL draft. We strongly feel that with your audience and your great influence, we can bring a larger spotlight to Lafreniere. Within this package, you'll find the following pieces. Once you receive these items, I would greatly appreciate if you take a photo slash video with the shirt and other items and tag at Upper Deck Sports and hashtag collect Alexi. So included are uh, all of these items. I'll go through them and uh, sincerely pull from the uh, Upper Deck Company. A big thank you to everyone for this and uh, let's go over everything that was sent to me. So the first item, and uh, I can't actually show it here because it's so massive, is an Alexis Lafreniere jumbo card and this is from the CHL SP game use set it is a massive exclusive trading card and I mean that is so cool I have to find a place super special to uh, put it up and uh, I mean that is just such an awesome card also included is this Collect Alexi shirt. I'll uh, put it on and show here uh, because once again, it's really big. It's a nice hoodie, very nice and soft. And again, that is just an awesome exclusive item. Also included is this super awesome upper deck hat. And that is just so cool. I'm definitely gonna be wearing this at uh, future card shows. There is also this water bottle here with uh, Collect Alexi hockey cards. Very nice. And I believe there's also a straw inside. Actually, I'll take it out here so uh, we can get a better look at it. So here we go. This is it. The Collect Alexi water bottle with the straw. And then also we've got <laughs> pretty much COVID related. We've got this very nice mask from Upper Deck. I love how we see the MVP logo, SPX, Upper Deck, OPG, The Cup. I mean, even the ultimate one. That is so cool. Uh, definitely, definitely going to be wearing that around. Actually, let me open this up too. So here we go. This is the mask. Such an awesome looking one. And uh, wow, just so awesome. And finally, I also was given these items here that I'll be opening up right now. Two hobby packs of 2019-20 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey and a whole hobby box of 2019-20 Allure, one of my favorite products that came out this season. This is going to be my third opening of this product and a second on the channel and I'm super excited to uh, do this. So without further ado, once again a huge thanks to Upper Deck. Let's jump into this opening. So let's start off with the two packs of a 2019-20 Series 1 Hockey. Here are the odds on the back. We'd be hoping for a good Young Guns card, but uh, we'll have to see if we can hit that. Those fall one in every four packs. And so let's take a look at this. We've got Jordan Binnington. The photography is always just outstanding. Very nice. And then Jeff Carter. We've got Marc-Andre Fleury. And then Derek Stepan. And a UD canvas of Thomas Hurdle. Very nice Thomas Hurdle. UD canvas card, and then Dylan Larkin, Justin Schultz, and Philip Heedle. Okay, so second and final pack of this Upper Deck Series 1. Nice little bonus to get here. And so we've got Mark Giordano, Troy Stetcher, Casey Middlestadt, and a Joachim Nygaard, Young Guns rookie. So we beat the odds, got a Young Guns here of Joachim Nygaard, the Edmonton Oiler. 
Very nice. And then we have Nicholas Jalmerson, Braden Chen, and then Damon Severson and Alexander Barkov. Okay, so that was the extra bonus packs. Now we've got an entire hobby box of Allure. We're going to get eight packs in this box, and there are six cards in every pack. Upper Deck has also announced that Allure will be coming back next year for the 2020-2021 season. A bit of a different format this time. Eight packs per box still, but there are going to be eight cards per pack. We are guaranteed one autograph and one memorabilia card in this box. Can hope for a golden treasure one of one. That would be pretty cool. Uh, without further ado, let's jump into this wrapping. Okay, so I've removed the wrapping here. Very nice. Jack Hughes there on the cover. And I love how this box opens up. Oh, and I almost forgot once again about the uh, stickers here on each side. Forgot about that the first time, the second time, and I've forgotten about it again this time around. Okay, let's open this box up here, and uh, actually I'll just take the packs out because uh, it's going to look nicer like that. We're supposed to have eight. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs of Allure, and let's close up the box here and leave it here on the left side. Ooh, if I can actually close it. Come on, there we go. So, box of Allure, here are the eight packs fan them out like this and actually I'll move the uh, young gun and canvas card away so here we go let's jump into this hobby box allure let's take a look at what we can get here hopefully a, a good name for the autograph that would be pretty sensational we've got a jersey card coming right up so first pack seems like a, a jersey mojo pack so we've got Matthew Barzal these are the base cards super shiny very nice looking cards uh, very reflective. I like the look of them. Nick Suzuki, Allure Top 50. And is this a jersey right here? Yep, looks like it. Oh, no way! Quinn Hughes, very nice. Quinn Hughes, Allure Top 50 jersey. That's a big hit. There you go. In the first pack, a jersey that has been certified as being worn by Quinn Hughes. That is so cool. Allure Top 50 jersey. And uh, there's not many more players that you'd want to over Quinn Hughes. Maybe Kale McCarr would be one, but uh, that's a very nice card. And then a Noah Dobson rookie and a Max Jones rookie. So this product is very much rookie filled. You get a lot of rookie cards per pack. And it was actually available on Upper Deck E-Pack, but uh, it's not anymore. It's, it's sold out very quickly. Uh, this is definitely a popular product. And we've got an orange slice coming up. Mark Scheifele, Connor Hellebuck, and then Brad Marchand. And we've got a Rem Pitlick rookie short print. Now you can tell that it's the uh, short print because there aren't the lines on the side. A bit of a different design compared to the regular rookies. And I guess I'll go show the Rasmus Sandin regular rookie in the back. And uh, what do we have here? Seems like 29 is that uh, Leon Dreisaitl. Very nice. Leon Dreisaitl orange slice. And that is numbered to 199. So 41 of 199. Just like OPG Platinum, this is a parallel heavy product. So you're going to be getting a lot of those. And there's always the chance that the Golden Treasures one of one cards. Seems like another die cut coming up. There are the red die cuts, the white die cuts, and this seems like a red one. So we've got Mitch Marner. Barrett Hayton is an Allure Top 50. And then a red rainbow of Connor McDavid. Very nice. Not many better names to get than uh, Connor McDavid. And then we've got a rookie of Zach Senishin, Mark Giordano base, and Max Domi base card. Okay, five packs to go. My guess is uh, the autograph is not going to be in this one. It's going to be in the pack after that. We'll have to see. Seems like, ooh, something blue. That could be a very low number. That could be really good. Artemi Panarin, Oliver Ekman, Larson, Quinn Hughes. Very nice. That is, uh, what is this called here? This is, oh, I don't even know the name. I think this is the uh, pink diamond parallel, maybe. Uh, rookie, that is super cool. Then we've got a John Tavares Winter Storm Warning. And, oh, we've got an autograph here. It's a Canuck. Could this be, oh, six? Is that Jake? No, oh, oh Guillaume Brisebois. All right, I, 
There's a lot of names that uh, I thought this could be, but I mean, rookie autograph of Guillaume Brisbois. Well, that's not terrible. 11 of 35, so very low numbered. And this is definitely a Canuck filled box. I wish this was the Quinn Hughes. Uh, that would have been very nice, but uh, Guillaume Brisbois, still cool. Anders Lee and uh, Nico Sturm, rookie card. Okay, so I guess I was wrong on that autograph prediction. We've got uh, four packs to go, so we're halfway through this opening. Let's see if we can get anything bonus here. We've got Alexandre Texier, rookie, and then P.K. Subban, then Quinn Hughes, Allure Top 50, and then a Brad Marchand. This is the white rainbow parallel. And then we've got Victor Olofsson, rookie, and Phil Kessel, base. Okay, keep on going. That was probably the weakest of our packs, but still good amount of uh, inserts, which is uh, very much appreciated. Seems like another white rainbow coming up. We've got Johnny Goudreau and then Nico Hischier. Cody Glass iced out. Very nice. I like that. And then an Alex Ovechkin white rainbow parallel. Very nice. Jake Gensel and Nikita Gusev, rookie. And the cards are completely falling down there. <laughs> and then uh, we've got two packs to go. So let's see if we can get any other hit. I have seen a few boxes with bonus hits, so it is possible. We've got something green here, actually, which is a good sign, I think. So Barrett Hayton, rookie. And then Anthony Mantha, base card. Ryan Paling, Allure, top 50. And Capo Caco, Allure, top 50, green. That's out of 50. Wow, 21 of 50. Wow, that is so cool. Oh my god, that's one of the ones you want to get for sure. That's a low-numbered parallel of one of the best rookies. Wow, that is a beauty. Wow. I don't actually know the name of that parallel. That's uh, very cool. And then Barkov and Bishop. Let's see here. What is uh, What are those parallel cards? Top 50 green border out of 50. So just the uh, green border. That could be uh, worth a good amount though. Capo Caco. One of the uh, better names to get this year for sure. Now, let's see, can we get uh, any other numbered parallel here in this last pack? We've got Matt Duchesne, Jack Eichel, Eric Brandstrom, rookie card, and then Kirby Doc. very nice. This is the short print rookie. And then Miko Rantanen would be a uh, red rainbow parallel. And then Cam Atkinson to finish off the pack. So there you go. That was a very nice box of allure from Upper Deck. I'll just quickly do a bit of a recap here. We got some parallel action, got a Miko Ranton in red, a short print rookie of Kirby Doc, Brandstrom rookie, a very nice Capo Caco green out of 50, Allure top 50 of Ryan Paling, Barrett Hayton rookie, Nikita Gusev rookie, Alex Ovechkin white rainbow, an iced out of Cody Glass, a Victor Olofsson rookie, Brad Marchand white rainbow, another Allure top 50, this one of Quinn Hughes, and then Alexandre Texier rookie Nico Sturm. Our autograph in this box was a blue line auto of Guillaume Brisebois, numbered 11 of 35, so very low numbered hit. And then John Tavares winter storm warning, and then we got a Quinn Hughes pink diamond, I believe this is called, rookie card. And then we got a Zach Seneshin base rookie, Connor McDavid, red rainbow, Barrett Hayton, Allure, top 50. Got a Leon Dreisaitl, orange slice out of 199. And then a Rem Pitlick, short print rookie, Rasmus Sandy, Noah Dobson, Max Jones, regular rookies, a Quinn Hughes, Allure, top 50 jersey. And finally, my man, Nick Suzuki, Allure, top 50. So, uh, wow, that was just awesome. A big thank you once again to Upper Deck for this awesome collaboration. This is very much appreciated. And remember to follow the steps to give yourself the chance at winning an amazing package like this one. This is just so awesome. I really appreciate all of your support. This would have never happened if it weren't for uh, you watching my videos. So a uh, big thank you to everyone who uh, took the time out of their day to watch this one. And uh, best of luck on winning a package like this of your own. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you all next time.